Hi there, welcome to my channel Mathusiasm. Today I want to show you this question of number theory about 2023. If a square plus 100a plus 2023 is a square number, find all the integer values of a. The first step is quite obvious. We let a square plus 100a plus 2023 equals to b square, where b is an integer. Now we have a single equation, but two unknowns a and b. How can we solve it? To start with, we're going to put the unknowns a and b to the left and the constant 2023 to the right. Then we get a square plus 100a minus b square is equal to negative 2023. The two square terms on the left hand side will minus an important identity x square minus y square is equal to x plus y times x minus y. This is the difference of two squares. However, we have an extra 100a, so we have to consider a square plus 100a together. The best way to do so is to use another identity, x square plus 2xy plus y square is equal to x plus y whole square to make a perfect square. This method is called the completing the square method. In other words, we should add 50 square on both sides of the equation to get this. The three terms in the bracket can be factorized as a plus 50 square. So the equation is simplified, and now the left hand side is the difference of two squares, while the right hand side is equal to 477. Next, we can further factorize it for the first identity to get this. a plus 50 plus b times a plus 50 minus b is equal to 477. Because a and b are integers, therefore the two bracket terms are also integers. So we're going to list out all the factors of 477. Obviously, the first one is 1 times 477. It is also equal to 3 times 159 and 9 times 53. If we reverse the order of the two factors as shown on the right, there are six different combinations of a plus 50 plus b and a plus 50 minus b. However, if we have to solve for a only, then it's not necessary to reverse the order. Why? Let's look at the following two combinations. The only difference is the order of the factors 1 and 477. If we add up the two equations in each system, then we get the same result. 2a plus 100 is equal to 478. Solving this simple equation, we get a is equal to 189. Therefore, we only have to look at the three combinations. But still, we miss out some integer factors of 477. It's because we have to consider the negative integer factors as well. Apart from the previous three combinations, we have three more from the negative factors. That is, negative 1 times negative 477, negative 3 times negative 159, and negative 9 times negative 53. In total, we get the six systems of linear equations in A and B, which are shown on the screen now. Just like what we mentioned, we add up the two equations for each system, then we get the six linear equations. Solving each of them, we've got the six solutions of A. Ultimately, we have solved the problem of square number in 2023. If you'd like to watch more interesting math videos, please check out the links of my videos and playlists shown on the screen. I'm happy to see your views in the comment section below. See you in the next video. Bye!